It's been making waves across the country. It's been causing people to wait in lines for hours at a time. It's been the reason for numerous brawls and controversies. And it's back. It's Popeye's Chicken Sandwich. Popeye's began selling chicken sandwiches on August 12th of this year, thinking it was just another addition to their menu. But when Twitter and internet culture took a hold of it, it became a viral sensation, one that people couldn't resist trying out for themselves. The first week, nobody knew about it. Um, so it was like business like normal. Uh, the second week, however, that's when Twitter picked up on it. That's when we had the line to the door. We had no idea what to expect in terms of how much we were going to sell. So we were selling, we sold out of what we had prepared, which was like a couple hundred sandwiches each day. The sandwich was so popular that Popeyes announced it was officially sold out of chicken sandwiches just two weeks after it hit menus. This caused the company to go on a three-month chicken sandwich hiatus to prepare for the upcoming demand. The shortage caused some Twitter jabs from iconic and long-established chicken supplier Chick-fil-A, who consumers are now arguing has the inferior chicken sandwich. I think, personally, I've had the Chick-fil-A sandwich on campus. This yeah. one, twice as good. Okay. Much meatier, the bread way better. With Chick-fil-A being a popular destination for on-campus eating, and the closest Popeyes only minutes from Cal Poly, it seems Chick-fil-A no longer has a monopoly on Slow's fast food chicken sandwiches. And it will be interesting to see if this trend fizzles out just as fast as it started, or if Popeyes is here to stay. I'm Taylor Garvey for Mustang News.